The third annual Sunshine Benefit Golf Tournament for the Medicine Hat and District Health Foundation started off with an impressive display of military machinery as a Battis helicopter unloaded an array of projectiles at a target on the Desert Bloom Golf Course. But of course, in this case, it was balls and not bombs they were dropping. Well, we're at uh, the Desert Bloom Golf Course and uh, we are holding the Sunshine Benefit, which is a fundraiser for the Medicine Hat and District Health Foundation. And uh, we have been very generously sponsored by RBC and uh, it's a great event, uh, lots of fun. Uh, tonight starts with the um, helicopter ball drop where uh, people buy tickets and they drop golf balls on the fairway and the closest to the hole, and then one, two, three, four, five, all win prizes. Yeah, uh, ball drop, fairly exciting. Uh, obviously our third annual uh, ball drop, uh, coinciding with the, the Sunshine Benefit, which is uh, held at the golf club. It's an exciting time for us here, uh, you know, with the, obviously the state of the economy, to be able to pull this event off with the support of our sponsors. Uh, we feel very blessed to be able to pull this off. So. It was one of those tournaments where the owners of the golf club uh, wanted to have an involvement back in the community and wanted to partner with a corporate uh, entity in town as well. And so this is our first year uh, being associated with the tournament with uh, the Desert Bloom Golf Club. And uh, the whole purpose is to give back to the community and uh, to make our, our community a better place. And, and uh, we believe that contributing and doing what we can to, to do this tournament well, uh, we'll do that. Uh, the purpose of this event is just another way that the Health Foundation is able to raise funds to enhance health care here in Medicine Hat. And uh, we do all sorts of different activities and we, as I said, are very fortunate to be uh, uh, connected to, today with a uh, very generous uh, group, the RBC group, to uh, help us uh, raise money for some specific equipment for the Health Foundation. In years past, the Sunshine Benefit has proven to be an extremely successful and fun way to raise funds for a variety of hospital equipment. One item the Health Foundation may be considering for purchase was on display in the clubhouse. You know, the first two years of the event we've raised over $100,000. Um, know, hopefully this year, depending on how things go, we'll be right around the forty to fifty. Uh, $1,000 mark and uh, you know, the first year the funds went towards the uh, maternity ward and uh, last year we bought the isolettes uh, so and this year we're working on the vein viewer so uh, you know things at the hospital that are, are you know for comfort and to assist in, in the procedures that go on there on a daily basis so. This is the vein viewer and what the vein viewer does is it's able to show on the surface of the skin through projected image the veins or the vascular structure of a particular patient. How or why this is important is a lot of times when patients come into the hospital, 90% of patients require either an IV or need a blood draw and most people are afraid of needles so they would rather be stuck only once versus two, three or up to 10 times. And this device will help the nurse or clinician find that vein faster with less pain. So at this point, what we do is we just shine the light onto a patient. If you're able to see that, what we'll see is the veins on the hand. We can actually flush and refill so I can actually see the veins working and the blood flowing through them. I can look and see which vein goes up further, whether there's any branches or any little knobs in them. And if I choose that this hand's not maybe a good start, all I have to do is go to the next hand and take a look and say, okay, there's a really nice vein right here. And that's where I'll start with this patient. It's a near infrared light, so it's just a special light that goes just slightly below the skin, doesn't hurt, it's just a special color. And then that light binds to oxygen and then sends back an image, which then reflects back onto the surface of the skin, the actual vascular nature. It takes a great deal of coordination and cooperation to put on a benefit of this nature and quality, with involvement from a number of sources including hosts, volunteers, corporate sponsors, and other interested parties. Oh, I hammered it! There's a great group of volunteers that uh, are um, 
pretty familiar with some of the activities and of course the Desert Bloom Golf Course is um, very experienced at this, very generous in, in helping us out with this and uh, they do a great job always. Well, you know, our ownership group, um, they wanted to be involved in the community. Uh, it was very important to them that uh, they be involved in the community of Medicine Hat and they wanted to basically have a charitable event. Uh, so, you know, we, we found ourselves a corporate sponsor and uh, lo and behold, here it is, we're going on our third year, so we're excited. I think on behalf of Fifth Avenue Wealth Management of RBC Dominion Securities, um, one of the things that's really important to us is to find avenues to make our community better. Uh, the basis of our clients are live in this community and in this surrounding area. So anything that we can do to, to make things better for them and for us uh, from a corporate perspective is important to us. This event, uh, I believe, is going to be one of the premier events in our community, not just from a golf tournament perspective, but from a charitable event perspective. Uh, our goal is to have a long-term relationship with Desert Bloom and uh, to, for years and years, make this one of the premier events in our community. Well, I'd just like to say that um, any way that uh, people can help support the Medicine Hat District Health Foundation is wonderful. This is a great, fun way to help us, and we really appreciate it. Every, every dollar that's raised actually goes to, uh, towards the purchase of equipment uh, for the Medicine Hat District <laughs> Hospital and the services that are provided. So uh, it, it's always good if you can do it in a fun way. Uh, Medicine Hat is very generous and district they're very generous in donating and you know when we can make it fun that's even better. For Shaw TV, I'm Rob Sparks. Look at that. And to think you didn't want to be on TV. Well I think it's you. There we go. I'm you your good luck. You must bring charm. me luck. <laughs>